and insert it in your Omni scan. And magic! MXU 4.4 is up and running, and you can start making some money. All right, so today we'll talk about the most common type of error that uh, we face in uh, using while well, using OmniScan MX2s. Right now, it says there's no SD card. Please insert a storage device, and it also says the current storage device contains no compatible applications. Now, I'm going to try to put my SD card in the machine, and it does take that message off so it does detect the SD card but it says there is no current contains no compatible applications now if you've come across this error then here's the solution okay you're gonna take that SD card out and use your laptop so I'm gonna put my SD card in the laptop and I'm gonna open my SD card and format so it's gonna delete everything that's on there okay so you right click it you click on format and it's gonna give you a warning that will erase all the data files on the disk if you haven't copied your data files then make sure you do that first so you can go to the user data and copy your data files but if you've already done that then go ahead and click format erase okay it's pretty quick formats completed okay next step is to go on your browser and open type these words Olympus NDT software downloads. Okay, once you do that, look for this thing. It says software downloads Olympus IMS. Click on that link and you'll see a list of software downloads available on their website. Scroll down and click on OmniScan. Okay. And then if you're using MX2, then click on OmniScan MX2. And then you'll see the, the latest version 4.4. Click on download. Now, most of y'all won't might might not have username and password on the Olympus website. So I'm gonna assume that you don't if you do then just go ahead and enter the the login but if you don't so in case you don't have your login then you can fill out this um, form which is pretty fast you can just enter um, ABC inspection services okay once you fill out the ID and the password check the accept and agree to the terms of use and download. Are you sure you want to submit the form? Yes. Okay, so now that I did that, it gave me an option to download this file at the bottom. I'm gonna say save as. Mm. Let's just make it simple. MX2 files okay and save it on my desktop here's the thing you don't want to copy these files on your SD card okay that's where people make mistake you don't want to copy the files directly onto your SD card what you want to do is open the folder MX2 files and extract all okay so open that folder and say extract all 
and extract those files. Okay. Okay, once it finishes the extraction, it's going to open the location. And now, instead of copying these files on your SD card, what you have to do is select this one, install OmniScan, double click on it, because it's an application file. It's going to give you this message. Run it, so say yes. It's preparing the set of files. Click next. And then over here, it, it asks you to choose the destination drive. This is where you're going to choose your SD card. Okay, so this is E drive is your SD card. Okay, look over here. It says SD card is E drive. So I'm extracting the set of files to the E drive. Next, select the MXU 4.4 software next language English so it's the destination drive is your SD card language English and applications MXU 4.4 now it's asking you do you want to format this drive you already did but just in case if you want to do it again just say yes because there's nothing on that drive anyway so you can format it again now it's installing the required files on your SD card instead of you copying the files on your SD card okay so it takes a little bit of time you can see it's installing the probes the models of all the different probe library angle beam library for conventional okay for contact testing of UT dual element so these are all the files that were missing when it gave you the error message of saying no compatible files found okay all files installed install completed once that's done click on finish now you can go to your SD card over here if you click you'll see three three files app three folders app update and utilities so those three should pop up and then you can click on your SD card over here and eject it so now you're ready to remove your SD card and insert it in your OmniScan and magic MXU 4.4 is up and running and you can start making some money.